all gases including air are bad conductors of electricity under room temperature and pressure but these gases can become conductors at very low pressure and high electric potentials which led to the invention of the device known as the discharge tube a discharge tube is useful in the study of conduction of electricity through gases it is interesting that the pressure inside the tube can be varied and the gas to be filled can also be changed a discharge tube is made up of glass with two electrodes fused into the tube the electrode that is connected to the positive terminal which is the higher potential is called anode a and the electrode that is connected to the negative terminal which is the lower potential is called cathode c the pressure inside the discharge tube is varied by connecting the inlet or outlet which is b of the discharge tube to the vacuum pump the milliampere connected in the circuit shows the conduction of electricity now let us discuss about cathode rays cathode rays are produced when the pressure inside the discharge tube is nearly 0.01 mm of mercury properties of cathode rays are one the rays travel in straight line and cast shadows the rays leave normal to the surface of the cathode number 2 the cathode rays have sufficient amount of kinetic energy a mica vane paddle wheel placed in the path of the rays will rotate the rays produce fluorescence when the rays are focused on substances like zinc sulfate a green visible light is observed when focused on diamonds they exhibit all colors depending on the quality of the diamond number 4 the rays are deflected by magnetic field this shows that the cathode rays consist of particles number 5 the rays are deflected by electric field the rays deflect towards the positive electric field this shows that cathode rays carry negative charges and are known as the stream of electrons number 6 cathode rays penetrate through thin metal foils number 7 when the rays strike a heavy solid metal x rays are produced number 8 cathode rays are made up of fast moving electrons the velocity of cathode ray is 1 by 10 of velocity of light number 9 cathode ray particles have a mass of 1 by 1840 times the mass of hydrogen atom some of the applications of the cathode rays are cathode ray tubes are modified into the present day television picture tubes and computer display tubes these rays are also used in glow signs for advertisements and tube lights in the houses